G'day, Peter here. In February 2020, I was diagnosed with motor neuron disease. I came to the realisation pretty quickly that I had two decisions to make. One was to say, to MND, and the second was to make a choice between being happy and not. I chose happiness, and this is how I did it. I hope you enjoy. To me, the, the first one that comes to mind is probably the, the most difficult as well, is um, to understand yourself and, and to know who you are. Um, you know, I think I'm pretty fortunate in being able to do that, that um, I've, always, I've always known that, I've always sort of had a good feel for, for who I am and, and, um, and where I fit into things and um, when to stand up, when to speak up, when to stand, you know, stand aside and not make any noise and those sorts of things. And I've kind of got to the realisation that whilst it's terminal, I, you know, I don't feel as if um, I'm dying at all. It's a ridiculous sort of notion to think that um, you, you, I know what's where it's all heading and, and what's going to come of it all. But you know, it's not it's not a driver for me. Um, I'm accepting of of where things are at. It's a broad set of words to say to know who you are and everything else. But I think it's critical to to being able to peel back the onion, as the saying goes, and and really analyse why you feel the way you feel and why you do the things that you do. I think without sort of knowing where I sit personally, what my you know what my drivers are, what my goals are, what my values are, that I wouldn't have the ability to sort of to understand the notion of of coping with adversity and, and coping with my illness. Yeah.